Do something for free? Why? That's unbelievable. I can't believe you did that. I kind of thought that you were lying. All right, everybody, I'm going to surprise AP and drop off my mower to the mansion that he's working on. I'm going to do that right now. All right, surprise him with the mower. Now let's get to our yard real quick. What's up, beautiful people? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today's video, I got a super awesome one because I'm doing a complete makeover on an abandoned mansion in the middle of nowhere. I'm telling you guys, this house is huge. I actually started it and I've got a lot done, but there's still a ton to do. And I think today's video is gonna be the most satisfying of them all. If you haven't seen the last two videos, go ahead and check them out. But I'm gonna have to hustle today because I ran into a few problems. Let me show you the mansion that we're making over real quick. It's behind me right here. This house is huge. But wait, there's more. You can't even see it right there. But by the end of this video, all that will be made over so i ran into a few problems i'll tell you the full story at the end of this video of how we even got permission to do this abandoned mansion in the middle of nowhere but my problem is i guess someone hired someone to put bob wire fence around this whole property and i might get locked in if i don't finish in time so i'm gonna make this intro super short because i got a ton of work to do and i really don't want to be stuck back here but yeah i'm gonna go ahead and explain what i'm doing in today's video so today i'm gonna get rid of all the palm fronds that's hanging off the palm trees and i'm also gonna do a full makeover on the stairs get rid of all the vines got some bushes that needs to be trimmed got a bunch of debris i gotta pick up and i'm gonna turn this stoop into a super beautiful stoop <laughs> But like I said, guys, this yard's completely out of control. It might even be more out of control than my beard. Let's go ahead and get to work because time's ticking and I don't want to be locked in here after dark.
Look, that's a scary looking spider right here. Creepy. Might be a brown recluse. So oh, we're out of here. That's one thing that makes me a little uneasy is spiders.
This grasshopper landed right on my hat.
I go ahead and show you the reveal let me tell you how i even got permission to mow these properties at first i didn't have permission at all but i called ap and the lawn care juggernaut and said hey you guys want to drive up to ocala and mow some abandoned mansions i don't think it's ever been done before on the youtube lawn mowing world and they said yeah so all three of us drove we'll just go ahead and do them they're abandoned let's go over there we drove up here there was a gate and we couldn't go in so i called the number that was on the gate the realtor and she gave us permission she gave us a little bit of the, a rundown on the house she said that they were trying to get someone to mow and it was going to cost them six thousand dollars each house which is unbelievable so we told them hey we'll go ahead mow them for free the houses might get some views on them and then they might sell and she was on board with it i guess it was like a family compound and there was a family feud and everybody ended up splitting ways i'm not even too sure that's pretty crazy because these houses had to be a lot of money they're over 7,000 square feet and they're actually really nice from the outside but i really hope you guys enjoyed this transformation the sun is going down right now look how beautiful this is nothing around is beautiful got deers walking got wildlife all over the place i really hope you guys enjoyed these transformations i'm actually leaving tomorrow to head back home long care juggernaut he's staying here he's gonna finish up his mansion ap i'm not too sure i'm gonna get with him see what he's doing so check them out check out their channels and yeah this was a super fun project i'm so glad i got to do it i got to experience it with two of my friends and you guys i love bringing you guys along with me but what do you think this project took a long time we put in some hours on this one. Don't forget guys, I post a video every Tuesday at three o'clock and I almost forgot they were building a gate around here. So let's see if we're locked in or not. This is how say P's working on over there, but we can make it out. So that's a good thing. I forgot to tell you guys, we're not gonna be able to collab on that fourth mansion because we underestimated how long these yards were gonna take. And I have to be home tomorrow to get to my family. So, but anyways, I figured it was you out there cutting. Yeah, it was all three of us out there cutting it. It, it ended up turning out really good. Yeah, well, they were awful. Yeah, they so, were they were like pretty I bad. Said, that's that's unbelievable. I can't believe you did that. I kind of thought that you were lying. You're gonna go like squat out there. So. Oh no, no. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of like a sketchy. I don't know. It's like sketchy to pitch to someone, you know. Uh, yeah, oh, she thought is. we might be squatting. Like, you want to do something for free? Why? <laughs> why are you doing that? Yeah, but uh, oh. I see why that oh. quote was so much. So that was some work right there. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I can't. Honestly, like I said, I can't believe you did that. Yeah, um, so, wow. it's crazy. Like, I was just doing some research and stuff, and people are saying those houses are haunted and stuff. I said, it is creepy in there. Uh, I don't think they're haunted, but I think <laughs> he was like, I mean, I, I think he was involved in drugs and sex trafficking and some other weird <laughs> stuff like that. What? Jeez. Yeah. That's yeah, it, it's a yeah. wild, it's a wild place back there. Yeah. Yeah, it Pretty is. Cool, it's very though. private, very secluded. Nobody can see what you're doing, you know? I was expecting, like, we were going to be the only ones out there, but people were looking at them. Like, we had people yeah. look at them just wow. about every day. Yep. Wow. Okay, well, I, thank you. I don't even know what to say about that. One that's closest to 44. Uh-huh. The one that you can kind of see 44 from, it's a bigger piece. With a fence? That, so that one's sold? It, well, it will be sold in a couple weeks. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, that's cool, yeah. Um, yeah. Oh, yeah, it was wild back there. Uh-huh, <laughs> uh-huh. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I know it. Well, I appreciate you guys so much. Yeah, and, th thank uh, you for letting I, us do it. Sure, sure. I mean, I don't know why I'd say no. <laughs> <laughs> well, we drove all the way here. We were like, I don't even know if they're going to answer or anything. And then I seen the gate closed, and I was like, dang it. 
And I was like, I don't know what I'm going to do. Where did you guys stay? Um, well, my buddy, he came from Oklahoma, and he brought his camper, so he just put his camper back there. Holy crap. And I, right. I stayed at the, uh, I think it was called, like, Brownwood. Okay. Well, I appreciate it so much. If you have any other photos, definitely forward them to me. And I'm going to get my photographer back out there, because, damn, they look good now. Yeah, right yeah. Right now's the time to get photos. So yeah. going to look better than right now. Yeah. Yep, right now is probably the best time. Well, all right. But well, all right. you guys so much. Thank yep, you. not like, a problem at all. taking off today? Yeah, yeah. Got to get back right. to the family. Yeah, I hear ya. Thank you so much. All right, thank you. Okay, bye-bye. All right, bye. So they bought the first property, the one that I ended up doing. And he's, he's giving us a little history lesson about this property right here. So the property was bought originally to be set up for houses and the family. And there was ditches dug all the way across the property so the guy could drive his boat from one house to another. <laughs> <laughs> well, he, he never pulled permits on any of them. So he's just got never trouble. pulled permits on the houses. Never pulled permits on the ditches, dirt work, nothing. So basically, the property got taken away from him by Swiftman. That's crazy. So the state came in and took the property. That's nuts.